You know what? It's the people, to be honest. Uh, we have, and not just the business people, it's the complete community. Um, everybody, I call it the kind of downtown cheers. The people are wonderful here. Like, you know, it's a big, it's a good sense of community. Of, uh, I feel like the people here are like family, to be honest with you. The downtown is looking amazing. We're looking forward to seeing the end result. Uh, the construction company is, is amazing. Yeah, it's a really good facelift and I think it, it was needed. They said the infrastructure needed a lot of work. It looks and feels rejuvenating and it's changed for the better. We moved from Egypt in 1997 and uh, my dad is a pharmacist. He was looking for a pharmacy. Um, in 1998, he came across uh, MacArthur Drugs. Uh, the pharmacist here was retiring, so he took over. This is actually the second oldest pharmacy in Ontario. So it's actually been a pharmacy for over 100 and almost 130 years now. So we're 12 and a half years now. Uh, crazy idea that probably since the time I was about 15, I wanted to own an antique store. My parents had one when I was in my 30s and I helped them out. And after a while, you just do your dream. It's always something different, something new. Uh, that's not the same stuff always. So they always look forward to, even ever, if it's a yearly thing, where they only come in once a year, they're always like, oh my God, it's totally different in here. We do that purposely. Yeah, I think one of the main reasons why the business does well is because it can produce a product um, that, that locals and people who recognize the name can really identify with. The advantage of naming a place after a region is it brings people uh, who are interested in your product to that region. It's, um, it's got, we probably got one of the best locations in town, right in, the, right in the downtown, just off the main street, right next to the lock system. It's sure to get a lot of people uh, interested, either I either know the area or are just passing through. We really wanted to create a experience of, you know, leaving downtown Fenland Falls, taking a walk across the bridge, coming through the fairgrounds, and then you leave the fairgrounds and you amble up through the woods and almost stumble into the space. I really hope that this place will become an anchor for folks to spend more time and uh, get to enjoy more of Fenland for a longer period.